Yo, know, what's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? How doing, y'all? Let me get myself prepared a little bit while y'all come on to the room. Y'all know what it's about. Y'all saw the thumbnail. Y'all saw the thumbnail. What's up, allegedly, baby? How you doing, sweetheart? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Get myself prepared. I'm going to come into the room. <laughs> that picture just does it for me, y'all. That picture just does it for me. Find it hilarious. Just hilarious. Just all kinds of funny to me. But yeah, so I promise you guys, what's up? Um, Shantastic Baby, what's going on, baby? Nikki, what's up, baby? Cutie Pie, Wild Card, what's up, babies? You guys, I promise you guys a special um, mukbang. And we're going to be mukbanging everything from the dollar store. What's up, Rochelle? Rochelle, baby, how you doing? What's up, my boo, Diana Goddess, baby? How you doing? Neptune, what's up? How, what's good? So it's Miss and Nikki. How y'all doing? We're going to do everything from the dollar store. And of course, you know, I'm going to talk a little shit along the way. Hope y'all are willing to come with me. We have meatballs. Shit. Meatballs from the dollar store. What's up, Purify? How you doing? We have spring rolls from the dollar store. We have a pizza from the dollar store. And a whole bunch of snacks as well. A whole bunch of snacks. I don't have, I don't, I don't do a lot of sodas and stuff like that was now, but I'm going to drink some water. But guess what I'm gonna do? I'm going to add some of this dollar store Hawaiian punch in blue to commemorate the fat bitch that's on my damn um, thumbnail. <laughs> Grimace's sister. His twin sister, I should say. What's up, Bulls? How you doing, baby? Yes, like this video on the way in, you guys. Like this video on the way in. And of course, we got a bunch of other stuff that we're going to be eating as well. While I'm talking ish about the fat bitch and everybody else who wants to keep on coming after me as if I'm not going to protect myself. I don't know what people don't understand about anyone and everyone can get it. I understand it's a clout chase. I understand it's a clout chase. Yeah, they have spring rolls, baby. What's up, lovely one, baby? How you doing? Where you been? I understand it's a clout chase. But is it really a clout chase? If you are getting embarrassed and drilled across these streets by the nappy kitchen that you have in the back of your head, is it really worth it to get embarrassed just to get a couple more subscribers? What's my top lid at? Oh, here we go. And as I said, just because they come over there, are they going to stay? Do you have something to keep the people at bay? Do you have something to keep the people interested in what you have to say? Is what you have to say so important that not only can you cipher subscribers from me, but you can retain the subscribers that I have. Even take some away from me. Hmm. We soon will find out. We soon will tell. It's a cloud chase. What's the cloud chase? Shit. On my neck. That kind of shit. I don't like shit on my damn neck. Maybe I should have pulled it a little tighter. Hold it a little tight. That's better. That's better. Let this dissolve up in there while I eat the rest of my food. Now that's the question. Do you have what it takes to actually retain or obtain and then retain the people that you want to um, cipher away from me? Time will tell, baby. Time will tell. Let me just eat one of these meatballs right quick. What's up, Phil One? How you doing? Blessed, so blessed. How you doing, sweetheart? How you doing, sweetie? Now all this food comes from the dollar Dollar Tree. It's a Dollar Tree meatball, y'all. It's a Dollar Tree meatball. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, because they can't really. Um, do what I do. So I have to come down to that level every once in a while. You know what I'm saying? I have to come down to that level. What's up, Madman? How you doing? 
Nanny Pooh Love, baby. How you doing today, sweetheart? Yeah. So as y'all know, people have been coming out the woodwork, trying and trying and trying to get my attention. Trying as they will to make sure that I know who the hell they are. Because as you know, I don't know who the hell they are. What's up, Blue Bottom, baby? How you doing? Let's try the spring roll, you guys. Of course, my little duck sauce from an Asian restaurant. Let's see how this tastes. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Not bad. Have a little crisp to it. You really can't tell the you really can't taste the filling in this. What's up, Ram? I'm Tam. Sam Ram, baby, how you doing, baby? Well, not bad. You can't really taste the um filling, but you know, a lot of breading. Mm-hmm. Mm. Not bad. Not to my quality or standard, but not bad at all. <laughs> I saw some, but I didn't get that. I got something else besides potted meat. Let's taste this pizza, y'all. Are these the itty bitty pizzas people been talking about for a while? Let's try the pizza. See how this tastes. Mm-hmm. It's not bad. It's not good. It's, I guess it's also a pizza. It is what it is. Okay. Let's, put Let's go back in on these meatballs. Hey, Miss Leo, baby. How you doing? <laughs> What's up, TC, baby? How you doing today? Mm-hmm. Mm. So yeah, everyone wants their opportunity to get cussed out and get skull drug. Hopefully they can get some subscribers from that. And for all the ones who be saying, well, you do the same thing as they do. You're doing the same exact thing as they do. You talk about folks too. That means you're a cloud chasing too. That means you're a cloud chaser. You're a cloud chaser. You're a cloud chaser. Mm -hmm. Am I really? Isn't cloud chasing defined as or is similar to the fact that I choose to put someone's name in my video, talk mad mess about them was not, hoping to cipher away some of their subscribers and then switch them over to my side? Hmm. When did I do that? When have I ever done that? What I do is talk about the mess that's here on YouTube that people do. I don't sit up here and try to go after people who are, I guess, trending at the moment and talk and mention their name, call them out their name, lie on them, hoping to get their attention so they can mention my name in order for me to get their subscribers from them. That's what clout chasing is. What's up, Shorty C, baby? How you doing? Clout chasing isn't talking about what people do here on YouTube. Cloud chasing. Hello, Regina Show. How you doing, baby? Cloud chasing isn't when you are just speaking on things that is going on in the environment that you're in. Cloud chasing is when I'm speaking ill towards someone hoping to garner their attention. What's up, Mia? S baby. How you doing? And hopefully they respond to me so with a negative negative consultation with us so we can go back and forth with each other. So we can feed off of the negativity that we are putting out there in the air. That's what cloud chasing is. And I don't do that. What I do is talk about what's going on. Hopefully people are entertained by what I talk about what's not and they choose to actually, you know, 
subscribe at that point. But for me to go back and forth with you would be ridiculous. For you to think that I do the same thing as these cloud chasers do is ridiculous. I don't sit up here and think of who am I going to attack in order for me to get some clout. I don't sit up here and think who am I going to befriend in order for me to get some clout. That's not what I do. I talk about everything and everybody. I talk about anything and anybody. I understand what the point about anyone and everyone can get it. Don't people understand? I don't get it. I understand that. <laughs> and see, my thing is, it's not just her. It's the individual in my thumbnail who chose to be very, very disrespectful for no reason today. You know what I'm saying? You're taking up for somebody who won't take up for you. You are willing to get skull drug across these streets for someone who will not be there for you during that time of, in, in your time of need of getting skull drug. I'm confused. Are numbers so important to you that you're willing to get embarrassed? Because you may be black. You may be fat. You may be ugly. That's it. <laughs> That's it, you grimace looking bitch. That's it. You fat, black, and ugly. And it's a difference that you continuously say, well, I'm fat and black and ugly. But it's a difference when you put your face to that voice. It's different when you put that face and that body to the description. You know what I'm saying? When you look like Grimace from the McDonald and Friends collection, you hate me, allegedly. <laughs> I love me, baby, and I love you too. Thank you so much. When you put a face to that voice, when you put a face to that body, when you put a face to that image, it makes everything very clear as to why your ugly ass is behind a black screen by force. Because you can't talk the shit you talk the way you talk it and look like that and think that you wouldn't be skull drugged across these streets. You know what I'm saying? You can't be talking the shit you talk the way you talk it and think that what's up, Miss B? How you doing, baby? And think that you can't and won't be skull drug. You understand what I'm saying? See, the difference between me and you, I choose to be behind the camera, to be in a black screen every once in a while. You have to be behind the black screen all the time. You don't understand that Numbers really don't mean anything. What's up, um, Juanita, baby? How you doing, sweetheart? Don't really mean anything to me. While I'm getting them in this moment, last week I wasn't, and I wasn't doing all this bullshit addressing all these motherfuckers, people who choose to come at me the wrong way and attack me for no reason whatsoever without any provocation. It doesn't have anything to do with you, but yet you want to insert yourself in it thinking I won't skull drag your incoherent, ignorant, belligerent, ghetto ours you see how i do this with ease you don't have the wherewithal to go back and forth with me you don't have the comprehension skills or the reading skills or the speaking skills to go back and forth with someone like me you just don't what's up everybody what's up everybody what's up everybody what's up everybody What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? Baby, you don't even have the comic timing to go back and forth with me. A comic relief, you are, yes. But you don't have the comic timing to go back and forth with me. What's up, Castro, baby? How you doing? You don't have the vocabulary to go back and forth with me. You know what I'm saying? You can't fathom 
Your brain don't even work that way. It's not in your genetic makeup to do so. Physically. <laughs> Basking in all. Or mentally. What's up, Chris Cross? How you doing, baby? Summer Riley. What's up, baby? How you doing? <laughs> you don't have that mindset. You don't have that wherewithal. Your ability to speak incoherently and in short spurts of um, things, vocabulary, tells me that you're fucking retarded. And nothing against people who have mental disabilities was well, not. It's a difference between someone with a mental disability and some incoherent, retarded bitch. You know what I'm saying? There's a difference. You see how I do this? You see how I easily weave things in and out, in and out was well, not? Let me get another bite of my food doing this mukbang. Because if you're mukbang, you have to eat something. Once again, everything is sponsored by the Dollar Tree, y'all. Dollar Tree Meatball. Mm -hmm. And y'all, instead of um, potted meat, I got Ms. Leo, baby, don't be mad at me. <laughs> oh, yes, Ms. Leo. This is a receipt, baby, right here. This is a receipt. This is a receipt. What's the date at? What's the date? Da, 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 da. Right here. This is the date right here. You see the 30th? Right there. That's the date. I got you covered. I told you. You act, I give you. You know what I'm saying? That's how it works. See, Grimace, you don't have this type of capability. First of all, you don't have the finances to do it, even for a dollar tree. <laughs> but you don't have the wherewithal to come up with this type of idea of what's not to roast and gag someone. You know what I'm saying? A lot of cussing and fussing and rah, 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 rah. Will you see me holler at me? Will you see me holler at me? Will you see me holler at me? No, bitch. If I see you, I'm going to kick your goddamn pussy and run. Because you scare me. That's what I'm going to do. But yes, back to my mug bag. I have this buffalo style chicken salad from the Dollar Tree. Oh, yes. Is that a pot of meat? See, you want to play this game back and forth with me? You want to go back and forth with me? You want to see if you can hang with someone like me? I'm telling you, you can't. <laughs> y'all like this video, y'all. I know there's not 64 people in this uh, room just watching me eat this um, Dollar Tree food. I'm just saying, like the video, please, you guys. Help your boy out and like the video. Mm -hmm. And you see how her shirt was blue? I got my blue drink to match that. And please thumbs up the video, guys. You guys, please thumbs up the video. Like I'm saying. You want to sit up here and insert yourself into business that doesn't concern you, that doesn't pertain to you, have nothing to do with you, hopefully to keep your numbers up. What's up, Vesha, baby? How you doing, sweetheart? I put my little crackers right here, you guys. I got a whole little meal over here. Mm -hmm. Are you hungry yet, baby? Your stomach growling? You fat bitch? <laughs> I'm just wondering. I'm asking for a friend. <laughs> I'm asking for a friend, you fat whore. Yes, Dollar Tree. Sponsored by the Dollar Tree, baby. Yes. Oh, let me smell this, y'all. Let me smell this. I don't want to eat it, y'all. But see what I go through in my comic relief for you guys? <laughs> this is what I'm going to do for you. Well, I'm still going to roast and gag and score drag this fat, nasty, ugly, gravel throw ass bitch. He said, don't do it. <laughs> Phil, I have to. My people want, my people want, my people expecting me to do it. I have to do it, Phil. I have to do it. Ugh. 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 Y'all, y'all see this? Ugh. Buffalo style. This smells horrible. I should just read the ingredients in it, shouldn't I? Read that. Before I eat, I'm going to read the ingredients to make sure I'm not going to die. The ingredients. Cooked chicken, celery, what's this? Oh, celery sauce, sauce, cayenne peppers, distilled water, natural flavor. Okay. Just smells disgusting, y'all. Just smells disgusting. Careful. 
David, you worry about me? You want me to be careful, baby? <laughs> I'll be careful, David. Okay. Ugh. Mm. Not bad, but hit you right here. I won't be eating that again. No more bites of that. That's done. One and done. Like these whores that I'm dragging right now. <laughs> One and done. Mm -mm. So, so far, what we had... So far, what we've had, hey, Mr. Professor Pat, baby, how you doing? Is Dollar Store Pizza, so Dollar Tree Pizza. <laughs> I'm going to get sick, baby, but thank you, though. <laughs> we had Dollar Tree Meatballs, Dollar Tree Egg Rolls, and Dollar Tree Buffalo Chicken Salad and Crackers. We also had Dollar Tree Blue Drink in commemoration of this fat bitch who won't keep on trying to seek attention. You've been ignored by everyone. Everyone ignored you. Every, well, sometimes it is what it is, baby. Now, I told you about the bacon, um, I told you about the bacon, um, cotton candy. Here we go. Bacon cotton candy, y'all. We're gonna try this one. Hey, Shalee, baby, how you doing, sweetheart? Okay, baby, I appreciate it. Love you too. Bacon cotton candy. It smells smoky, y'all. It smells smoky. It smells smoky. <laughs> See, fat, ugly, black, dumb bitch. You can't do this. You don't have the wherewithal. You don't have the tenacity. You don't have what it takes in order for you to retain, obtain, and maintain anything that I have over here. It's sweet. It tastes like liquid smoke and sugar. It tastes like liquid smoke and sugar. It tastes like liquid smoke and sugar. It's not bad at all. I eat the rest of the bag. I'm not going to throw it away like I'm going with that damn buffalo chicken salad. Y'all, please lock, like this video. Vegetable is not nasty. Y'all, like this video. This is entertaining. I also told you guys about these right here. I told you about the chili lime. Things are similar to take you whatever it's called. Let's try these. Ooh, they're hot, y'all. Look how these are fire. See how red that is? I'm all that seasoning on it. You're trying to cut the candy, Miss B? It's not bad. Call that sauce on my fingers. All that red sauce really touching the tip. Mm, it's hot. But good. It's a hot but good. Mm-hmm. Mm. This is good. These are good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Fire. <laughs> Some tons or something, right? Mm. Mm. That's good. It sure is. See, bitch, you need to be on camera, on in front of the camera, in order for you to do shit like this, in order for you to compete to roast and gag me. 
You can't drag me. There's nothing you can do and or say behind a black screen, you incoherent, illiterate whore. Sorry, you're not a whore because people actually wanna, should want to fuck you. Unless people are into the fetish of fucking grimace. Like I said, whore, I'll take your girl from you and your dad and your brother and your uncle, bitch. I like her dudes. You know what I'm saying? Those are the first one to call you daddy once you're inside them. Slow stroking them. Ha ha ha, bitch. Like I'm saying, you can't do what I do. You can't roast and gag. All you do is blurt out incoherent bullshit that doesn't make sense. Throwing together syllables and words and hopefully something sticks. Grasping at straws and shit. That's what you do. You don't have the tenacity, the wherewithal, the mental capability, the wordplay that can compete with what I do and who I am. And all of the people that you're sticking up for, where are they? Will they be there for you? You went from one group, got kicked out. Another group got ostracized. Those two words mean the same thing. To be ostracized is to be kicked out. <laughs> you, how I'm, you see how I'm reading you and also giving you a lesson in grammar at the same damn time while still eating my food from the Dollar Tree? This is what I plan on doing with my people anyway this weekend. They'll tell you. I told them, was it Thursday, Friday, that I'm planning on doing a um, mukbang from stuff from Dollar Tree? You see how I can incorporate what I want to do anyway while still skull dragging your bitch ass? Now that's talent. That boy got some talent. Mm-hmm. He sure do. Of course. She's stupid. She don't do her research. What she does is she go from one group, because she went from this person initially. To this person initially, to that person initially, to this person initially, to this person initially, to this person initially. Now you're back where you started. We finally made it. Bitch, it took you long enough to make it. <laughs> you were the dumb whore to spend $200 to get your computer password unlocked. When all your dumbass had to do was reset, bitch. Delete, alt, okay, that's our control, alt, delete. That's all you had to do. But no, your dumb ass, your dumb ignorant ass paid $200 to get your password reset. And all you had to do was control, alt, delete, bitch. See, you don't have the mental wherewithal, like I said before, to fuck with me. You can't keep on thinking that you are this top-notch reader roaster was not. See, everyone else ignored you. I'm just roasting gag your ass with calling your fucking name. <laughs> like I do best. Baby, this is what I do over here. Your leader should have told you. See, she sent you out to slaughter. And you think because you got a couple subscribers under that belt was not that it was okay for her to send y'all to slaughter. It's not okay, baby. It's not okay. Big, fat, ugly, black grimace wants something to eat. Let's try another one of these little um, spring rails grimace. I know your mouth is watering watching me. You ugly bitch. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. At what point are you going to understand that when I ask you to leave me alone, I mean it. Not when you get around to it, but when I ask you to. Talk about the shit that I do, but don't lie. Don't try to name call because your names are lame. Calling me, what you call me, a faggot? Baby girl, that's the best you got? 
You're absolutely right. I'm married to a whole man. What's up, Leandro, baby? How you doing? I'm married to a whole man. So how is that offensive? What's up, Mimi, baby? How you doing, sweetheart? Nice to see you again. How is that offensive? Call me a faggot? I'm supposed to be upset about that? Huh? But aren't you a big, ugly, black dyke, though? Don't you eat pussy or want to eat pussy? See, that's what the self-deprecating, ugly people do. What's up, baby? How you doing? Grimace and his sister or brother, whatever you want to call it. So you're calling me a faggot, calling all the other black men on here faggots. But aren't you the black, ugly, fat bitch who want to eat pussy? Explain it to me. How does that work? Hmm? How does that work? Are you upset because you're too ugly, too fat, too black, too musty, too stanky, pussy, too rotten that you can't find somebody to engage with you in? So you're upset at the people who actually can do that and actually live their best life. I'm just asking a question for a friend. A friend wants to know. <laughs> You see how I do this, baby? You see how easily it comes to my head and rolls off my tongue? You see how easily that works? Are you sure you want to get into the arena with me? Ask yourself this. Ask yourself, mad? Who's mad? Uh, oh, no, not me, not mad. <laughs> Why be mad when I'm glad, baby? I'm gay, remember? Ooh, ooh. I'm gay, baby, which means I'm happy. Why would we be mad? No. I'm just saying. Okay, who, who are you getting the strap for, baby? <laughs> Leandra's don't mind shooting up the place, baby. But Leandra, be careful. Some of these whores don't mind getting their um, throat shot up either. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So at what point is people going to realize that I'm not like everyone else? I told y'all I'm different. You can't embarrass me, especially the likes of people who look like the person on my thumbnail. How are you possibly going to embarrass someone like me? Self-admitted black, self-admitted ugly, self-admitted fat, self-admitted illiterate, and also show these things, self-admitted poor, Self-admitted wanting and longing for attention and acceptance. How are you going to effectively try to roast and gag someone like me? I'll wait. How does it work? I look at my life mm. that I'm extremely content with. I look at my pockets that stay on swole. I look at my husband. We both pull whoever and whatever, whenever we want. And that's going to make me be like, damn, this grimace looking bitch just called me a faggot. Damn. I should go kill myself. No, bitch, drink bleach and chase it with motherfucking rat poison, bitch. How about that? <laughs> because if I was you, it looked like you, shaped like you, sound like you, mentally disturbed as you are, that's what I would do to myself. I'm just saying. I would drink bleach and chase it with rat poison. So, we still going to do this? Let me know. Come back with another two-minute video and see how good you are. Come back with another little five-minute video and see how good you are. Bitch, I go on 
on with you for hours. I told you I got a strong back and lots of stamina, bitch. Did I tell y'all that? Did I tell you that, baby? And I'm only flirting with your bitch ass because you're ugly as fuck. I know you've never been flirted with before. I'm just saying. You see, I can do this. I can go back to forth and back to forth what's not on your motherfucking ass and still not be out of breath. Bitch, you can't make a three minute video without breathing hard. <gasps> when you see me, holly at me. When you see me, holly at me. Bitch, take an inhaler. Do something else. Don't fucking come for me. Like I said, no one else will, will address you. A motherfucker like me will address you when I call your name, but just uh, skull drag your bitch ass all across these YouTube streets. You see how that work? Do you understand how this is going to go down? You probably not because you're illiterate and you're fucking dumb as fuck and you don't have no com kind of comprehension skills. So let me do. No, I'm gonna do that. That's not. That be mean. That be mean. That be mean. Back to my mukbang, y'all. Back to my mukbang. So we had bacon popcorn, bacon cotton candy, the, the um, chili lime chips, the buffalo thing, the meatballs, the egg rolls, spring rolls, the pizza. Let's try some more chips. Zaps. Cajun dill gators. Gator taters. Let's try this. Let's see how these taste. Ooh. Exactly the nebulizer. These are good, perfect. These are good. Mm -hmm. Taste the deal. Not bad at all. What's up, Donna here, baby? How you doing? Welcome, sweetheart. Mm hmm. Mm. So. And let's talk about the real reason why the tour is mad. Everyone knows what went down on Monday. Monday, Monday, Monday was not people got bit out of shape. This dumb whore made three videos about me was not big up in me. Nigga, I was going to sit up here and give you some props or give you some attention. No, bitch. I see how you move. I see how you've been moving for the past several months. Scratching and begging for people to come support you. Scratching and begging for people to come big up you, to come subscribe to you. Looking for people to carry your big, fat, heavy ass up a hill. Get off your fat ass, get on camera, and do the fucking work yourself. Period. Period. Stop looking for people to give you something, to hand your fat ass something. The government already hands you a fucking check for free for being overweight and being fucking obese and fucking um, crazy as fuck. Now, since you big up me was not because of what you thought happened on Monday, And heavy, heavy, you got so heavy, baby. Heavy, heavy, you got so heavy on me. That one right there, that song, Heavy Baby from Dream Girl. <laughs> you see how I can do this? Interact with my people, still roast and gag your ass, and still stay on topic. Can you do this? I'll wait. Can you do all this in your three-minute videos? I'm just asking for a friend. See, consistency does not mean making a thousand and one 
two minute videos. Consistency is being consistent in who you are and showing people who you are so they can get an opportunity to like and or dislike. All we, um, hey, Ms. Ray Allen, baby, how you doing, sweetheart? I'm sorry if I didn't see you, sweetie. And everybody else who comes in here, you guys, welcome, you guys, welcome, 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 welcome. And please like this video, you guys, on your way in. Please like your video. Please like this video, you guys. What those small snippets of videos that you call videos of commentary is, is a bunch of incoherent gibberish. You babbling on camera about absolutely nothing whatsoever. Now, once understand what you're talking about, who you're talking about, and why you're talking about them was not. Your content is cloud chasing. Your content is using someone else's name in order for you to garner views from that individual. That's what your content is. Your content is not you actually telling a story, being progressive and coherent, and moving forward with the whole process was not. Complaining about people didn't big you up. Complaining about um, the fact that you fat, black, and ugly. Complaining about, I mean, I'm sorry, praising the fact that you're fat, black, and ugly. Praising the fact that you are incoherent and ignorant and ghetto as fuck. That's content? Oh. So I should aspire to be grossly obese, obese, I should say, grossly obese. I should be aspiring to be illiterate and incoherent and on government assistance. What about you says, I want to be that right there. I want that to be my friend. I want that to like me. You've been dismissed by everybody, baby. Until you went, went, went back groveling to where you came from initially. What's up, Gloria, baby? How you doing? Welcome back, baby. Hmm? What about you and your content says that? What about you and your content says I can actually befriend someone and they can actually trust me. You attack everyone that you try to befriend. You talk shit about everyone that you try to befriend. First, your whole uh, modus operandi is you're going to big up them. And when they don't do that, well, it's not you go against them. How does that work? Then it is, if someone so don't like them, well, it's not let me be their Guard dog, or I say bulldog, was well, not. What's up with you, baby? How you doing? How you doing, baby? Fine, I hope. And then you attack them for them, was well, not, until they turn on you and kick your ass out. Then you go back into attack them. How does it work with you? I know you're slow as fuck. I know you're ugly as fuck. How does it work with you? I'm asking for a friend. How does it work? Hmm? How does it work? What's up, Renee, baby? How you doing? You think that it goes, you know what I'm saying, that people don't know what the fuck you're doing or who the fuck you are? It's hard to miss your ass. We all see you. We all have been seeing you. Man, Pam, baby, don't do that, sweetheart. Don't do that, sweetie. I haven't mentioned a name yet. In 45 minutes I've been on here. In 45 minutes I've been on here. I haven't mentioned a name. But everyone knows who I'm talking about. The black, ugly, fat, gravel throat bitch who stays behind a black screen but talks shit to everybody. You saw the thumbnail. The grimace looking bitch. The grimace looking bitch. The bitch that been unemployed since the McDonald's Playland have been in non existence. Where's the burglar at, bitch? Where's the fry guys? Where's Chickadee? Where's your friends at? The McDonald's friends. Where are they at, Grimace? I'm just asking a question. We all want to know. 
Have you been getting government assistance since that um whole run? I'm just asking questions. I just want to know. And you still want to go back and forth with me. <laughs> Linda, Linda, listen, Linda, listen, Linda. Asking a question. Yes, the hamburger baby. The fry guys. Where are they at? Chickadee. Where do you, where's your friends at? You didn't miss anything, baby. It's just that people are going to keep on trying me. They're going to keep on talking shit, hoping for a response, hoping I'll call their name. I will not say your name, ugly. <laughs> your new name is Grimace. Your new name is Grimace. I have no idea why the toys and Happy Meals are now trash, baby. But when Grimace was on their job, they had some fire toys. They had some fire toys when Grimace was on their job. Yeah, you do, Miss Pam. You know that person. You know that person. <laughs> you know that person. What up, everybody? 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 <laughs> you know who that is. Where you see me holler at me? <laughs> <laughs> no, bitch. Like I said, I'll kick you in your pussy and run because you scare me. You scaring the children. You are scaring the children, Grimace. Don't it sound like Grimace? What a bad, bad, what a bad, bad, what a bad, bad, what a bad, bad. You think that shit is cute? <laughs> you think that shit is cute? I'm just asking. At what point is that shit cute? And you think you have the wherewithal and a stamina and a artistic and comedic um, aptitude to fuck with someone like me. You can't even fuck with my wordplay, baby. I just gave you three words back to back to back that mean the same thing but all different ways. You can't do that. <laughs> baby, that's what they sound like, baby. That's what they sound like. That's what they sound like. I'm just saying. At what point do you think that I'm just going to sit here and just keep letting people attack me, throw themselves into business while it's not, thinking that it's okay to do so? It's not okay. Leave me the complete fuck alone. I tell y'all all the time. I don't care if you mention me. That's fine. Mention me all day long. Mention the shit that I do here on YouTube. But don't lie on me. Don't try to attack me and not, not to defend myself. But I can do it without calling you by your name. And give you no clout whatsoever. See how that works? Do you understand? Can you comprehend how that work? Right. So you think that people who are capable of listening to me and me speak coherently is going to gravitate toward you and listen to gibberish? Like you talking like a foghorn on longhorn situation? No, baby, that will not happen. Like I said, people may go over there without to see who the fuck I'm talking about and see who the hell I'm dragging. And once they realize that what I'm saying is actually true, they laugh at you and move the fuck on. I need to stop being messy, Miss Pam. I love you, but stop being messy. You know that's not who I'm talking about. On site is not fat, it's not black. Well, she's black, but she ain't black. And nothing against the dark skinned people at all. But I'm saying, when you come after me, well, it's not with some bullshit. I will be snatching your motherfucking wig. Period. I'm sorry, you don't even have, you don't, you don't even have edges. You don't even have edges. With them braids look like fucking stitches in your fucking head. Yeah, we saw the picture on, on the thumbnail, bitch. 
The braids on your head look like stitches. I'm just saying. Ridiculous. You make no sense whatsoever. And she's watching the video now. She's watching the video now last night, thinking that, oh, well, oh, he's talking about me with that. Bitch, don't talk about your motherfucking ass. I'm talking about you. I'm not really talking about you, if that makes sense to anyone. It's ridiculous. <laughs> she knows who I'm talking about. She knows exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> Look, Pam acting silly like she don't know what's going on. What's up, Keishana, baby? How you doing? I'm just saying, like, when do people not... <laughs> they do. You don't see them braids in that damn picture? Like, fucking stitches? Like, someone bust a bitch in her head several times? And they just stitched it up? Going back to cornrows and shit? Leave me alone. Nothing you can say. This, like I said, this will be the first and last time I ever talk, talk about you was not. I drug one whore this morning was not, and she thought that it was the best thing since, go, since um, sliced bread. I hope you do get some subscribers based on me. They realize you have no content, they leave your ass. Same with you, Grimace. Same with you. Just saying. Y'all start stuff when y'all get drug. Then you realize that everything that you did wasn't worth it. You start things, realize what you're doing isn't worth it, and then you is left there doing what? What's your end game? Mm. Mm. I'll wait. I'll wait. Trina C, baby, I'm just saying. You look like that. Sound like this. And you have to actually talk about somebody. Your entire life has said no to you. Your past has said no. Your present is saying no, and the future said hell no. If you leave me alone, I won't even bother you. And when I say leave me alone, I don't mean don't mention me. I mean don't lie on me. Don't think you're going to attack me and expect me to sit here idly by and do nothing and say nothing about that. Don't insert yourself into something so hard. You don't went hard in the paint. For what reason? Bitch, you still didn't make the team. You don't went hard in the paint for everyone, and you still have not made the team. I'm just saying. What's your end game? What is it that you're trying to accomplish? I'll wait. Doesn't make sense to me. Back to the up thing. Just saying. This right here are the caramel macarons from the Dollar Tree. Now everything that I'm eating is based on from the Dollar Tree. How they look? I remember these when I was a little boy. In Chicago at the dollar store. Sorry, at, at, at the penny candy store. It's really sweet. Coconutty and caramelly. It's a lot. It's a lot. It is good. It's a lot. It's really sweet. Really, really sweet. <laughs> I'm always the bigger person. 
I don't ever address anyone unprovoked. Period. If you don't do dumb shit on YouTube, I won't talk about it. You get mad and want to attack me because what I've talked about on YouTube, I come at you full force. It is what it is. You're fighting for those um, <laughs> per five. They're good. I don't know those two, but those are something that everyone can get everywhere pretty much. So I, I ain't get the point lines. See, everyone wants people to be the bigger person. How about not doing the shit that causes people to come at you or, or to address you? See, people want attention so bad that they think that all attention is good attention. And I don't get that. Because I'd rather not be involved in bullshit and nonsense. Because it's take away from actually me doing what I want to do and just having a fun mukbang or having a fun situation going on here on YouTube. I don't. And the only time that I address people, sorry about that, the only time I address people is when they have addressed me or lied on me or said something to me in a disparaging way. And then this comes out. But y'all have seen me drag people in a multitude of different ways. A multitude of different styles. I don't have to just come out here cussing and fussing and screaming and yelling and calling you out your name or it's not. I said I could do it in a multitude of different ways. And I've shown you that I could do it in a multitude of different ways. I don't know you. You don't know me. So you're trying to get clout based on some bullshit that is some bullshit, literally. Hmm. How's that work out for you? Hope you get what you come for. And I hope it's worth it in the end. I'm just saying. I hope it's worth it in the end. All right. Just saying. Everyone wants to be the victim once they realize that they went too far past the line. People wonder why I say I don't do apologies, I don't do all that bullshit. Well, it's not. Because I don't do anything to warrant me to apologize for that I can't stand in. Hey, Bella, baby, how you doing? Always. Always. I don't ever just start something. I don't ever just come out the box talking nonsense with not unless someone provoked me. Someone tried it, tried to hide it. Someone tried it and think that it's not going to sit up here. I'm not going to see it or address it was not. What you all you have is these YouTube numbers. I feel sorry for you. If all you have is these YouTube numbers and these clicks and views, I feel sorry for you. Doesn't make sense to me. That's, what's up, baby girl couture, baby? How you doing, sweetheart? Welcome, baby girl couture, baby. How you doing? Who looks thin? Grimace? Miss Pavino, you know what? Now you're gonna make me say something to you. Stop it. She don't look thin to nobody. She don't look thin to nobody. You don't see that double chin? You don't see that how that chin goes into them titties like this? You don't see how wide that damn neck is? Bitch like she got elephantitis around the throat area. No. Come on now, stop it. Now stop it. My thing is this. Everyone who thinks they're going to get something, like you get more subscribers based on what I'm doing, what I'm saying, and based on trying to attack you or not, this will be the last time you will be getting addressed. And I hope you milk this for all it's worth. (laughs) 
I'm gonna be looking for all this work. Because I'm gonna do to you like everyone else does to you, like your parents did to you, like your life did to, did to you. I'm gonna ignore you and send you on your way. So, sweetheart, I hope that you enjoy. <laughs> hope that you enjoy whatever falls, whatever comes from this. I hope that you enjoy what is going down because this will be the first and the last time you get any of my attention. So you can talk all you want, call me all kind of faggots in a book, but the reality is you have to walk around in this world looking the way you do, living the way you live, Speaking, comprehending, and understanding the way you do. And I have to do the same. Thus far, I have had a better life being me than you have had being you. And the fact that I have no malicious intent and I don't do anything maliciously was not, I think that I will continue to have a better life than someone who goes around attacking people unprovoked in order to garner sympathy and numbers here on YouTube. So continue to do what you're doing and continue to have the same results that you've been having. I hope that you find some bleach that you can swallow and digest along with a chaser of rat poison and live your best life for the next couple of hours that you have. I'm just saying. You guys, thank you so much for joining me. It's about an hour of dragging this whore and eating. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please like on your way out. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. I will talk to you guys later. I love you guys. I thank you guys. And I pray that you guys have a great rest of your weekend. As I always say, love yourself. Love someone else. Respect yourself and definitely respect someone else. Not everything I say is meant for everyone, but the person that I meant it for, I mean it. Don't take it back. Won't apologize for it ever. And don't want anything from you whatsoever. Continue to do what you do the way you do it, and let's see how far that takes you. I'll continue to do what I'm doing, the way I do it, and see how far it takes me. Remember, numbers don't mean anything to me. But while I love my subscribers, and people who choose to support me, well, it's not. I can have a real life in real life that actually gives me the support, love, and strength that I need. That is not take anything away from me but give me what I need to survive to thrive and to live you can't say the same so have a great day this is your boy Food Junkie and I'm out bye you guys I love you peace Damn it.